Banshee, level 20 upgrade. Today I'm gonna to be installing STRC's blue aluminum bulkhead. Guys, I ended up finding this for a good price, so let's go ahead and open it up and check it out. All right, so let's go ahead and just pull the tab open, and yeah, we're gonna to have to cut this. That's okay, we've got some scissors. Cut this open, inside we have these two screws that I never use, and then we have the bulkhead itself, which looks really nice. However, I am gonna to have to admit, I do like the blue anodizing that Energy does compared to STRC. STRC has more of a flat, Energy has more of a brilliance to it. But either way, it's an aluminum bulkhead, so it's a must have for the RC. So let's go ahead and get this installed. All right, first thing I'm gonna do is remove the front bumper. It's held on with two screws. With the bumper out of the way, it's time to go ahead and remove the bulkhead. It's held in with five screws. We have three on bottom, and then two on top. Once those are taken care of, I can go ahead and slide the bulkhead off, and then I need to go ahead and take off these two screws that hold on the front shock tower. Once that's taken care of, the last thing I need to do is remove these two screw pins that hold on the A-arms. With that all taken care of, I can finally pull off the stock bulkhead. And now we can go ahead and compare it to the new one. As you can see, it doesn't have as many of the supports because, well, it's made of aluminum, so <laughs> it doesn't need those extra supports. But, oh, that does look good. So now it's time for the reverse process. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna line up the A-arms and then reinsert the screw pins. With that taken care of, I'm gonna go ahead and flip this around, and now I need to reinsert the two screws that hold in the front shock tower. Now, a quick reminder, since you are gonna be putting screws into the aluminum, you are gonna need some thread locker. With that taken care of, I can go ahead and slide the bulkhead into the chassis and reattach it. It's held in with five screws. We have two on top, of course, and then on bottom, three more. With those five taken care of, all that's left is to reattach the bumper. It's only held on with two screws. Here is before, and here of course is after. And guys, I think it looks great. It doesn't have that brilliant shine like the Energy one does, but you can't beat the STRC aluminum. Either way, it's a great upgrade to have, and I highly suggest you get it if you have a Rustler yourself. And that was a level 20 upgrade for Banshee.